come on, archers surely have a clear shot on some of them at least. Finally, an honorable, the honorable melee combat. And only my infantry line didn't budge. Could you run away a little bit fucking more? Okay, now the AI is showing again. Just stand here and here. For now. I'm not sure if they're gonna actually besiege the castle or the city now after this. They might lose too many troops. Although we should have enough. At least if they disband I can actually pick up all the remnants. And take the city with them. that experience okay I lost zero troops on that one and I think this guy is our on our side Let's not take any prisoners, since we're gonna lose them all anyway. That's not enough money. Let's see. Ooh, we need to increase our pole arms, actually. We're at the limit. Troops in your formation take 20% less morale loss. Garrison infantry and government settlements have their wages reduced Ooh, by 20%. Even more. Infantry in your party increase melee weapon skill by 30% while in shield wall formation. Troops in your formation you are leading increase their damage with pull arms by 3%. Definitely this. Okay, let's see. No, they're... Yeah, they're gonna run away. And maybe... Yeah, I could possibly get these in. Maybe start the siege on my own. If like a couple of them just come back, they could probably like attack me, deal some damage to me, maybe. Or they're just gonna stand there. Never mind, yeah, they're going for me. Let's see if we can now. Not gonna get a better position. And there's another army coming in. Well, another party, not an army, but still. Footman! Footman! 
Oh, look at that. A nice hill behind me. <laughs> I wonder how much our party capacity is going to increase once I actually get my brother in here. our archers are actually getting kills. Yeah, look at that. So that's so cool. Like them going up to the arrows and picking them picking them up. So good. So useful too. Means they can fire for a lot longer. If the enemy has a lot of archers though. Gonna throw the pilum? No. I guess maybe if they, maybe better if they don't put their shields down right now. They're getting bombarded by enemy archers. Traitors in here. The Sturgeons lo looks like they're actually dealing damage to us at this point. counter to these that's not fucking me actually just yeah that that's the last one lost four 40 troops only nine dead though Get some reinforcements though. Attack us, so let's upgrade our troops since we can. Yes. 
No, they're just gonna run away. Okay, fine by me. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. You can attack? And I gotta wonder where the fuck are our allies by at this point. They should be should be here. Oh, and I'm, I guess the question is, how the fuck isn't it the same map? God, we're not going to be able to get here in time, are we? But these are skirmishers, they're just gonna run away like bitches, right? Even if I had a decent uh, speed line, I would do fuck all against those. Should have joined the Western Roman Empire, right? <laughs> so we can actually fight the Pallic Empire or the Valandians, which are Gauls in this, basically. This time. And full lords taken prisoner. Guess we're gonna. Actually, we can't take all of those. Um. How many do we need to dump? I guess let's dump the mercenaries because they're gonna cost the most. Okay, so three more. Okay. 
Okay, for fuck's sakes now. Please tell me these guys are close. 8 hours, 17 hours. Sheesh. Now the question is, are they even gonna get here too? Now these guys might attack us. Hopefully they're just a... Of course there's another motherfucker... Oh, for fuck's sakes, man. Oh, God damn it. What's this? Battle number five here? In front of this city? down somewhat it looks like they don't have that many skirmishers at this time at least Soldiers, forward. Forward, forward. Cavalry, move. they do have a madman who's gonna charge in and actually kill one of my archers Bitch. No, he's dead now. He is fucking dead. Motherfucker. Two of them, apparently. Yeah, throw your peel at the arch at the horseman. Maybe you actually hit something. like have a feel for it if we're gonna use it in third person it's not that hard it's definitely easier in warband man maybe it's easier um, might be easier if you hold it overhead like this or if you actually use a higher foe that might actually help you too let's see yeah i'm at max the distance Hard. You might want to change that slide around. It might be actually easier then. If I could actually hit some of these now to show you. They're headshot. Chop my infantry line to bits. If another army comes in, I'm just gonna abandon this. Fuck it. Can't win the whole. Well, you can win the whole war by yourself, but it's fucking annoying too. Uh, as for the couch lancing, I actually didn't try it all that much. I don't think I actually use the lance ever. But the, the game is definitely lo more fluid, so that's probably why it's harder. It's not like you're a laser pointer in warband with the lance. Like it's, the r movement is rigid. 
Jeez, yeah, we lost all our infantry. Or we can just, you know, switch to the glaive on horseback, right? Just do this. <laughs> There's 24 of them left. Where? Oh, there. I guess they're retreating. I should be clan level 5 in no time. The, 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 we've regained so much renown from these battles. You, More troops. Nice. Let's pick up the Empire ones first. Never mind. We can't hold all of them. I guess let's get rid of the Slinger Levies. Him. Got a couple of more of these. How many though? Yeah, Glaives and the... Uh Two hand and axe, too. They just demolish everything. Thanks, Mixie, for the follow on show. I'm over the limit on, limit on what? Prisoners? Oh, come on. No, not much. We fought like. Four fucking battles here. It's fucking annoying at this point. Now let's check. How much time do our allies need to get here? Okay, this guy was supposed to be like last time I checked in eight hours here. The fucking bastards. Let's call more in. Uh, if another army comes in, I'm just I'm just gonna abandon the siege. Oh, for fuck's sakes! Although it doesn't doesn't look like they're gonna attack. Oh, please tell me these guys are close. 11 hours, 6 hours, 6 hours. Hopefully we can survive up up until then. I'm not going to get attacked again at least. Uh, maybe pretty fucking close. Okay, we're good. Nice. Finally. I wanted to take the city like an hour ago. It's gonna be funny if like another, uh, like a thousand man army shows up from nowhere. Is this their capital actually? I guess at the, how the fuck do I check that? Maybe I can't right now. Oh, God damn. Okay, so this is what? Battle, battle number six in front of whatever this city is called. Bolt cut hand. <sighs> yeah, Loxen, here we go again. And at least it's a different map this time, right? Well, the plan is the same. I mean, there's no other way we're gonna fucking... Oh god, we have... Oh shit.
Yeah, this is the problem with the AI. Look how many levies we got in the army. They're gonna get destroyed instantly. Okay, let's see where the... Okay, that's... Okay, this time we're literally gonna camp the hill. Cavalry! Move! Infantry! Look that way! Infantry! Wheel! Infantry! Form a shield wall! Yeah, maybe like having the red tint on this is gonna work out. Yeah, yeah, run away, you pieces of shit. That was enough of you. Jesus fucking Christ. I just wanted to besiege the city and take it, man. Is that too much to ask? They're just gonna hide behind the hill this time. Never mind. I see red man. This is gonna be a bloody day. is gonna get wrecked too since they're pretty shit yeah like most of them are levies at this point yeah 55 34 left. Oh my fucking god. I'm just better off not calling in allies at all. They're, they're gonna. Their shitty troops are gonna cause a mass rout. I wouldn't be surprised. Smack. What? How about you don't aim at me for a moment? Okay, this could work. Yeah, go around the infantry so our archers can actually shoot at you. I mean, these peasants should be scared of me, right? Well, that would be cool if you had, like, a morale debuff aura or something. So they run away when you're close. You know, I might actually start killing the enemy lords, executing them. They're pissing me off. Especially these ones, I don't want to fight Skirmisher Cav anymore. Just kill them all. Get rid of them. They're not gonna have Skirmisher Cav then anymore, right? In theory, that should work. These are my Carthaginians. Fucking pain in the ass. Six.
What's the losses I'll let these do? Do I literally like have all their lords as prisoner now? Do I just execute them all? Fuck them. Let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, less, 16, 15 fucking enemy lords. Yeah, it seems like it's barred. Like, Skirmish should have in any, like, warband game, or mountain play game, just prolongs the battle. Nothing else. They just prolong the battle. They're a waste of space. And they're shit at that. Like, actually defending their cities, so they die in pretty quick. Like, even the Shar in Prophecy of Pandor, basically, they are suck ass once you actually get to, in a close range with them. Okay, so can we besiege it now? Please tell me you're gonna fuck off. And you What? They're probably getting chased off or something, right? Because as is, we don't actually have enough troops to actually take this. Well, we kinda do. Kinda don't. Okay, let's build the siege towers and the battering rams first, then the catapults. Maybe I should... Let's see. Enemy range weapons. Maybe I should build ballistas. To take out their ranged shit than the other other stuff. Okay, finally, finally, yeah, get get over here. Is there anyone else we can call in? She's pretty fucking far away, but let's see if she can get here. Since this might take a while. I guess the only way to count. Well, never mind. I was about to say, uh, going to say that the only way to counter them is to get a lot of cav yourself. But that's not gonna work either, since uh, you know, it does take a long time for them to actually catch up to them. Oh, we're gonna have another. Oh, please tell me we're not gonna have another battle here. Oh, looks like we are. Yep. You know what? 290 I wish I could just see, actually see what troops they brought with them yeah yeah you get more troops in Those ballistas did fuck all to those catapults. I mean, the longer I sit here, the more troops they are they're gonna bring. Maybe I should do the same, right? Since we have the influence. And I mean, we're gonna get some troops, like, recovered. Yeah, we got 40 wounded wounded troops still. Look at how many fucking escaped. Do 
we start chopping off heads. Fuck him. Fucking vermin. That's what they are. Now who are you with? You're a traitor. <laughs> Definitely should have executed all of them. Honor minus two. How the hell am I this faithful? That's my question. I wish this like notification thing like finished off quicker. And we're only 350 or down away from level five. Let me just check something. Yeah, if I disable this, we're gonna lose party size capacity, so I can't do that right now. Oh, look at this. Oh, finally. We're actually getting money, nice. Okay, we're gonna have another battle here, but let's... Who the fuck is this? Oh, I'm gonna have a field day ex executing all of you pieces of shit once I beat your army. Here we go again. <laughs> what is this? Battle number seven? Um, looks like we got a pretty good position up here. What? Why are they facing up there? Okay, never mind. Of course, they have a shitload of skirmishers. Like the the relations thing is still going, man. I should definitely add like a button to skip all those or something. Maybe I should try to kill them in honorable combat, not not executing them, right? That would be a cool thing. If you actually like stab him in the head, they're automatically dead. There's no way they should survive that, right? Something like that would be cool. Also, good idea to make your infantry into a shield wall since the enemy that can like get through them then
Oh my god, the relations thing is still go oh for fuck's sake, that's gonna be there forever. Unless I quit out and restart. Re reload into the game. Yeah, it was funny, like most streamers playing this game would have this many battles like three streams. And I have like what six battles in like not even three hours of streaming. <laughs> Seven battles, however many this is. Yo yeah, right, and I saw another thing. There's a controversy about going around about like uh, people telling streamers they should play on harder difficulty and whatnot. And then, then there's people again like, eh, it shouldn't matter and whatnot. Like, I guess if you're gonna stream the game, at least play it on a harder difficulty than normal or easy. Of course, depending on the game. Like in, in this. Early on, it's pretty fucking shitty if you play on the hardest difficulty, and especially if you play like me. But uh, like a game like Spec Ops The Line, I guess, or Mass Effect. Try to do it on le at least the, like the one below the highest difficulty. You don't have to do full bar like I did, or Mass Effect on Insanity. I think that was the difficulty on that. Like if you're playing Rome Total War or any Total War game, I guess go on very hard. You don't need to go on legendary, I guess. Oh, these skirmishers are pain in fucking ass. Don't tell me they only got skirmishes left. No, they got infantry still. Could you maybe shoot them over there? Alright. Slingers. They can do fuck all. These guys are definitely the, the Kuzites. It just takes a while to kill them. Mostly because there's... Yeah, look at... Look. I guess the it won't be such a big, of a big of a problem here if their skirmishers actually retreated. Like, their infantry usually retreats pretty quick if you kill enough of them. But the Cav... Cav almost never retreats, you have to chase him down. Which is a big fucking issue. Oh my god. Just too many of them. I mean, the, 
This is not even like a mod, like Prophecy of Pendle or something, where you're supposed to like be a killing machine at the end. Um, what, getting uh, 30 kills easily? More, almost 100. This, I think one game. What the fuck's happening now? A standoff? Sure, move up. Move up and kiss him. They're just gonna sit there. Yeah, see, now some of them are starting to... No? Are they? No? Like starting to run away? Stop skirmishing for fuck's sakes. Who's left? Dead guy? More? Still heavy lancer killed an archer. Forty three kills. At least two of them died. Now let's just execute the rest. I got no more patience for them. Although that might be actually too OP, I guess. Since if you if you kill all the lords, well, like, what the hell are they gonna fight you with? Okay, so. Can we take the city now? Pretty please. I mean, we have a shitload of troops coming in, coming in, coming in, so we should have enough. Continue the siege. Okay, maybe. Yeah, those those will do fuck all for us. Literally. I have no idea where the fuck that is now, or do I even care? I'm actually surprised our cohesion is holding this long. No. You, you join the army. You piece of shit. Don't run away now. to do this now. Wait, what? Ah, sh Fuck, I'm gonna need to restart this then. No, no, we can do this still. Good. I do wanna... Okay, I can't change my weapons, but we're gonna do the siege anyway. I sent the troops in.
Oh, this is the low wall one. Look, even the Kazites cities are shit. Because you can kill them easily. Oh, we literally have only two archers. What? What do we have? Oh, I see what the problem is. The game fucked up the categorization of them. Would you fucking fire? I do want to activate the fire arrows, but that may crash the game. Let's actually see. Although it seems like all 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 the fire arrows are gonna do is just Would you fucking fire? Okay, I guess our archers are idiots, I guess. Yeah, looks like number two is archers only. Get them firing at least. Somewhat. I see your tower over there. Where's the other one? What the f? Okay, apparently we have an invisible siege tower. Yeah, we're supposed to have two. What? Okay, that's nice. Yo, li literally, what? Oh my fucking god. Nice job, Tail Worlds. Nice fucking job. At least this siege tower works. No. Move forward, then move back. I got an idea. Can't see. My guys use arrows, I'm gonna use them. Check indeed. Nothing. What the hell are they gonna do now? What? Nothing? Okay, at least they're not gonna try and go up the imaginary siege tower, I guess. Okay, how about you guys get in there? Like a, a grenade now, that would be so fucking cool. I'll just kill those instantly. Or if my guys on the catapult actually hit one of them, that would be pretty cool. Although this is not, not the chivalry that was ported from what? Gunstrike Source or 1.6? The Half Life 2 engine? I think, still think that one is is much better than the newer ones. Or maybe it's just nostal nostalgia, right? 
There we go. We only lost nine guys taking it. Oh, finally. Let's see how much money are we devastated. Fuck it. How much money are we going to make from... Selling all the stuff we got. This thing is all still going though. Okay, let's see. Weapons. 20k. Shields. 15k. Armor. 10k. Well, I was hoping for more, but then again, they are shitty troops. So that's not a surprise. Okay, doesn't look like we have a herd. So let's sell those though. Then all of these. And that's definitely bugs since we're getting the money. Stonks. Okay, let's see. We do... Well, we need an engineer, but at this point, I mean... I got high enough engineering skill. Yeah, none of these guys are any good. Uh, let's... I guess... No. Fuck off. Fuck off. I don't want to do anything anymore. I want to go chill out <laughs> for a bit. Or, let's see. I lost a lot of troops. That's the kind of kind of an issue. Let's form a smaller army. A hundred. Let's see anyone else? Let's get them those two in. And this guy, I guess. Nah, fuck it, we're gonna go for more. I know that costs a lot of influence, but still. Spanning it. Well, I guess I could uh, just load the save back in. I need... I don't think he needs charm, right? If he's gonna be a uh, steward. I think he might need trade for that, though. Okay, this def definitely stewardship. Let's try and take all of this. Or at least as much as we can before the peace goes through. Actually, this is going to be a good time to actually test it out do we get ladders in sieges even though we didn't build anything let's see what happens if we have time okay, lead the assault 